Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to learn about how to write test cases. If you want to start your career as a tester in IT industry, then you must know how to write a test case. This is basic thing which is expected from every tester. So before we move forward, let's learn some basic terminology to understand the concept better. So these are test scenario, test case, test data and expected result. This terminology is used in writing test case next uh, what is test scenario it is any functionality that can be tested to understand this in easy way let's take an example of email consider gmail when we hit gmail url in any browser we will be landed on a gmail login page once we enter the right username and right password we will be navigate navigated to mailbox this is the functionality this can be taken as a test scenario next one is test case Test case means possible set of valid and invalid executable steps of any test scenario. Um, let's take the example of Gmail again. Uh, for login functionality, we can consider few cases like user entering correct username and correct password or user entering incorrect username and correct password or user entering correct username and incorrect password so on. All these can be considered as test cases. So here we have two type of testings. Uh, one is negative testing and other is positive testing. If we give valid data or valid steps, then it is known as positive testing. Uh, like user entering correct username and correct password and he is able to log in into the application. And next one is if we give invalid data, that is known as negative testing. Uh, like uh, user entering incorrect credentials and expecting a error message to show up next one is test data to test the scenario we may need some data to input this is known as test data uh, in, case, in the case of login functionality uh, we can consider login credentials as a test data next one is expected result this is the output or outcome of any functionality next one is example so here i have given one example let's go through it um, test scenario test scenario is check login functionality of ticket booking system okay here i am considering ticket, ticket booking system and uh, test case is entering valid username and valid password and precondition precondition means uh, sometimes we may need to set up some data or download some application before starting our testing itself uh, it can be any type of task which we need to do before ta uh, before starting the test case that is known as a precondition and next one is test steps test steps are here are given test steps like open the application enter username enter password and click on login button so test steps should be clearly documented so that uh, anyone can understand and follow these steps uh, to get the result to understand the functionality okay next one is test data here for login functionality test data will be username and password next one is expected result as expected user should be able to log into the application and actual result means uh, whatever the result we are getting when we are performing the testing so when actual result and expected result matches it means the test case is a pass if it doesn't match it is a fail so this is the sample basic login functionality test case thanks for watching my video if you want to learn more about testing please subscribe my channel and go through the videos which i will upload in coming time thank you